Hi, I'm Yash. In this video, I'll be demonstrating how to paint fine grass details in the foreground. So now, as you can see, I've just got some color blocked in, mid-tone green color and some variations. And it's completely dry. I'll take my rigor brush and let's come right over here and start dropping in some grass individual grass and this is in the foreground so we'll do that taking in some lime yellow and sap green i've loaded in thick paint i've added just a bit of water so that the paint flows okay something like that and i've ensured that i've chiseled my brush considerably well and don't add too much of water and today I'm painting in acrylics I painted this one also in acrylics look at that load in the tip of the brush that's the required place where the paint has to be loaded just sort of drop it in we'll do it in all directions now we'll do on that again to brighten it up hmm. Now I've switched over to a liner brush, script liner brush and let's come right over here and start dropping in a few more grasses and let's come right over here too and just drop in some of those shorter ones we'll have some shorter ones even in the foreground just brighten that color a bit and barely touching the surface, do it very gently And some brighter ones will be over here creating now I'll go pretty flat on this and later come back and create that variation but now just laying that basic color as of now not trying to make them too long because when the highlights when they come it will occupy more space if you know what I mean, you would have seen the thumbnail. Now I'll take my number two fan brush and let's come right over there and drop in some long. And I've tinted lime yellow with just some sap green to paint this long. And as we're gonna come forward, just press, just press the brush against the surface and just pull it. But do it very quick. Okay, something like that. Hmm. Now load in some white on that liner brush and let's come right over here and just drop in some highlights. And something comes off right over here too. But it's that easy barely touching the surface looking for a very contrastish scene look at that skip some spots change the flavor a bit just go ahead and drop it in move the brush in all directions take your brush in all directions and something comes off right over here too. Turn the brush and do it on the opposite side. We 
see I get that fine strokes those fine crisp details play a very crucial role in the foreground elements especially when it's a grass Now I'll take in some Lamelo, my Rigo brush, and let's come right with the and just sort of drop in some accents of flower. Maybe another one. Don't follow any patterns. And as they're gonna come forward, they get bigger. Now I'll just take in some black on that same rigor brush after wiping it. Let's come right with there and drop in. But it's that easy. Maybe this one also has that. Fair enough. Now I've taken in some black with lime and blue and let's drop it in right there at the center to make it look realistic. <laughs> 